Hi guys, I'm Exec Chaos and welcome back to another episode of Sim Airport. We are playing the Satellites International Airport and we're making a fair bit of money. In the last episode we finished off uh, the, the changes to our security, we've opened up the store and the cafe, uh, we still need to redo the ticketing area, I want to close down some of these as soon as we can. But first things first, I want to uh, expand this area over here. So if I expand that, I should be able to run the taxiway all the way around and we should be able to put it like at least six of the big stands over there and I think that's going to be a pretty decent start for our uh, our um, our satellite our first satellite terminal so let me hit that button okay we'll purchase that land parcels uh, ooh, what's happened something's happened <laughs> okay so now it's kind of what did what exactly not sure so let's uh, close uh, close off the planning we'll start running it again um, just FYI I just wanted to have a look how we were doing before the end of the day with our perfect ops pieces um, and there is one that that left one minute late it arrived one minute late and it left one minute late it took exactly the right amount of time and I think because of that we're not gonna have our perfect ops bonus but it was pretty close to perfect um, nonetheless so that area is now available so I think uh, before we hit the end of the day what I want to do is I want to use um, this kind of opportunity uh, what I've done is I've already just leave that alone let's go page up so I've already expanded this section here to make ready for that mmm it seems like there's something here that we're gonna have to need to dismantle first so uh, let us see about that it can't dismantle so we then just demolish it uh, why doesn't it wanna why can't I remove this okay well let's see is there some kind of issue with this come on Okay, not too sure what that what's up with that, but let's get our uh, our objects here, and we'll get our um, our large gates, which is what we're using over here. Ah, oh, we're on the wrong level. That's why I continuously have have this. Why? This is something that I find really frustrating about about airport uh, sim airport, because look at this, look at this, that is just crazy. Now I have to expand the terminal even further just to be able to do this or trim it back by one, which is upstairs is not a big deal, but downstairs it's, it's a pretty substantial, it's not that big of an impact, but, uh, yeah, I'd rather just trim it back a little. Let's go upstairs. We'll trim it back. We'll demolish this piece over there and we'll build ourselves a new wall right there okay so guys get that sorted out for us we'll come to dismantle we'll go down a level and we will uh, sort out dismantling this yes okay so let's get rid of all of that we're gonna have to get that fence out of the way so go ahead and do that we should have all of that covered what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go in here and we're gonna go in here and dismantle that and that and that and that also all of these these are pizza ovens right we don't need all of them so we'll get, get go ahead and dismantle all of that I think that should be fine apart from the fact that we probably need to place another hot plate um, kind of something over there and a pizza oven pizza oven somewhere over there. somewhere over there. let's just do it over there perfect so with that in mind as soon as these things have been dismantled I can go and trim back the construction of that as well which is pretty insane uh, we s I think let's quickly have a look at what happened what ended up happening with our profit and loss for yesterday how much tax did we pay oh we didn't pay that much in terms of tax we paid for land 
but not for income because we overspent, uh, which is what I want to do. I want to not pay too much of the taxes if we're building the stuff, you know, building the stuff. Yes. Uh, yes. Okay. So all of that is actually working. I don't think we got, oh, we did get the perfect ops bonus. That's quite an interesting one. I didn't think we were going to get it. But seems like it was okay that they gave us a little bit of grace and leniency with that one thing that didn't seem to work out. All of these have been moved. So let's get our new walls in place. All the way straight through there. The kitchen is going to be a problem, I think. So I'll probably have to expand the kitchen. So we'll do that, expand our kitchen over there. Yeah, it's going to be a bit of a nightmare for now. The bathroom, nothing is actually working at the minute because of that. So not the greatest experience just yet. Our airline rating is pretty decent, but we will want to get reps and things assigned with two airlines so that we can get that airline stuff going up. I'm uh, oh, so sorry, that's passengers. We want to obviously work on that as well, but our airline interest is pretty decent also. So that's okay. So what we can do is we can start uh, demolishing up to there. Why are you guys just kind of hanging out over there? Really? What's going on? Oh, there it happened. Oh, you were just waiting. You were waiting on some stuff. Fair enough, fair enough. You were waiting on some stuff. Finish that off. We'll close all of that out. We, ooh, I don't want to demolish that. What I want to do is I'd rather just dismantle. No, cancel that. Uh, I can't cancel it. Can you believe it? Anyway, I just want to dismantle the rest of this. Get us a new door. <clears throat> Just a sliding door, right? We'll plop it in there and then we'll have to start moving the stuff in there yet again. So grab, grab the dismantle tool and let's just run through dismantling all of that also. Um, in this, at the same time, we can start looking at building our large aircraft gates that will now squeeze in here. So one there, one there is going to be the thing for now. Guys, if, you, uh, if you're enjoying this series, I would very much appreciate you hitting that like button. I do appreciate the support. It really helps me out. Um, it gets this, uh, this video shared around and stuff like that so that YouTube actually shares it with you, um, with other people who hasn't seen it yet, to, uh, so they can have that same joy that you are in, uh, experiencing at the moment. Um, and leave me some comments. Tell me what you think of this stuff. So for the cafe, uh, for the kitchen, we need um, a hot plate. Let's grab a hot plate over there, a prep cart. We'll grab a prep cart kind of over here. We'll grab ourselves a bit of a pizza oven over there and we'll get ourselves a refrigerator and we'll grab that, put that right over there. Excellent. So that should finish that off. Then we need to start looking at expanding our taxiway. Um, for now, it'll be like this. I'm tempted to run it around that, that side as well. Maybe not immediately important because I would like, maybe the one way loop is exactly what we need here. So we will uh, keep an eye. Maybe that's the next thing that we're going to have a look at. Um, up here, this is obviously still B, B1, B2, B3, B4 is what it'll be. It'll be B3 and B4 as soon as they finish the building there. So we can start getting more flights coming in that way. Um, I did um, expand our, our operation in terms of buses. So the buses now come every 15 minutes so we can kind of get these people out a little quicker. Uh, we need some doors. Grab the nice big doors over there. We'll slot it in like so and like so. Perfect. That should be done. This goes down to B again, B4, like so. We want some <clears throat> gates as well. The gate agent desks. Again, what we'll do is we will do a little something like this and like that. 
and like this and like that. So at least we've got those in place and we'll see how we sort out the rest of this. But I think there's a fair bit of space for us to continue the operation here. Uh, must be assigned to at least one gate agent desk. That is fine. We obviously need some more of this, maybe a little closer by. We'll see. And I'm very keen for us to get to remote stands as well. Remote stands is something that I just can't wait to, to, to test in this game. That would be really awesome if we can sort that out. Um, okay, with that in mind, we can now actually assign this to there and to there. Close. Close that. We can assign to here and to there. Close and close. And we also need to assign, if we look at these guys, right, they are assigned over there. Uh, we could probably make use of the same one. Maybe let's do that for the time being. We make use of the same one. But the other thing that I was looking out for is, okay, if we're going to do remote stands, let us quickly have a look at that. I want to see um, if we look at the remote. So it's only small, um, small remote stands, basically, that's going to be a thing. Okay, so if we then... Oh, it requires ground floor. Fair enough. Oh, still not on the ground floor. Okay, there we go. So if we do now remote stands, maybe it's like that and like that. So if I do two remote stands over there, okay, then these guys can bus over that way. I think that is a pretty decent um, attempt. So we'll see. We could squeeze in another one over here potentially. Uh, so we'll see. I'm going to just start it out by building two remote stands over there okay and then what I want to do is I want to do remote uh, bus pickup um, and I'm not too sure how that works but of course what we can do is we can just kind of slot it in we only have the two right so we'll just do that now, my view on this is how on earth do we connect this up? Is there like some kind of a road that we use? Or does that link, should that be linking straight to the taxiway? Which of course it cannot. So let's, let's just see if we go again to that. And we say, ah, oh, you can actually link it up to the taxiway. I'm not a fan though. So this is the question. We're gonna we're gonna mess around with this a little bit. So let's see if we go with roads. Then can we do we just gonna like link the road? Let's let's see if that's a thing. I'm not sure. I'm not sure how this works. But let's see if that's a thing. It kind of looks like it could be a workable solution. So we build that and see how that works. Let's quickly see how are we doing with uh, with everybody being out of here on time. This guy is going to be late again. Might might make it, but I doubt it's going. This guy's this is the same one I got late yesterday, I think. Oh no, maybe that one. That one might be the one. Uh, but it's, I think this guy is going to be late. I'm going to get this guy out in time. Departing late. Yes. That's exactly what I thought was going to happen. I'm so keen on getting these remote stands to work. Um, again, this is still going to be B. This is going to be B5 and what have you. Must be assigned to an aircraft gate remote. Requires a door to the terminal, which is fine. We will sort that out. That's B5 over there. Now, what we're going to need is those are all full up and these are, uh, we have some baggage. Okay, so we'll probably need another hanger over here. Let's grab ourselves another little medium hanger to slot in kind of right. Um, actually, this one we might move a little bit so that we can have room for. Yeah, so let's do that. We'll slot it in like there. Okay. And then we'll make room for the others. Okay, so now with that in mind, okay, now we need to assign this to that stand over there. Okay, so you're assigned. You, on the other hand, needs to go to gates B, and I'll assign you over there. 
If we say upgrade, what is it we're talking about? Nothing too significant. Okay. Now over here, what I'm wondering is, does this actually work in terms of buses? Uh, here we need, you are saying that we need a door to the terminal. I'm not too sure where that terminal door should be, but let's go ahead and say um, a sliding door uh, right in the middle like so. Or are we doing two or three or six doors? I'm not sure. I'm, I'm Honestly, I'm not sure how that, this works. But okay, let's start off with the central ones. We'll get ourselves a bit of a gate. I'm assuming we need a gate agent desk, right? You need something, right? Uh, uh, oh, yes, a gate agent desk uh, requires at least one angle uh, with an apron bus, which is, re uh, is reached by via roads or taxiways. Okay, fine. So that's okay. So I think this road setup is going to work. This is here. Now, let's see. Let's get ourselves... Um, at least two apron buses. I think that will do do the trick nicely. We'll get ourselves a bit of a gate um, over here, and I'm tempted that we just do the one. These will be smaller flights, so let's do just do the ones over there, and then I'll start moving those flights from this area right over here to these stands. Um, and then we can start removing this section. And, and, and finalize our ticketing area. So we are really going quite nicely. Let's quickly have a look and see if we had our... Oh, let's quickly reassign these. Um, this one is assigned to there. Thank you very much. And this one is assigned to here. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so now all of that's assigned. Oh, what is not assigned ah, is we need... We haven't started putting anything in here just yet. But we need a baggage depot. Um, over here. A baggage depot right over there is going to be built. And then we need to continue this thing along this way. So there's a fair bit of building that's going to need to happen over here. So let's quickly get that foundation piece running. How did we... <clears throat> oh, so we need to um, kind of expand it a little bit like so. Maybe something like that. Then what we need to do is run it a little like this and... and a little bit like that, so we'll run it in there. So yes, we are spending way too much money at the moment. But I think we will sort that out pretty quickly. We'll connect these up. Ticketing is going to be the next big thing for us. Um, I'm quite keen to see how this works. But I'm, yeah, these remote stands, man. I'm happy with these remote stands. Do, 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 do. I want to see them in action. I want to see them in action. So our satellite is looking pretty good. Pretty keen on starting to remove these guys as well. Yeah. Tell me what you think in the comments. Have you used the remote stands um, and how do you find them? Is it, is it, is it functional? Um, is this setup that I've done over here correct or do you have to put them straight onto the taxiway? Will this actually work? I'm assuming we'll see pretty soon. But yeah, please tell me what your, what your thoughts are. Okay, I believe we may have enough money to continue the foundation over here. Oh, just not enough. Come on, money. No, a little more. Come on, money. More money, more money. Come on. Get me up to 40. Yeah, almost there. Okay, there we've got 40 over there. Now let's uh, tie those together right like so. Nice. That's pretty cool. Okay, so that should be almost ready for business. Lots of planes coming in. Lots of money rolling in. People are yeah, pretty happy. Um, very unsatisfied with the environment. I can completely understand that. Hunger, um, I think should be a little bit, well, it's not too bad actually. Yeah, the environment is poor. We really need to spruce up the terminals. That would uh, help a lot if we can actually get that done. 
Okay, let's go and dismantle this piece. Oh, there's also the templates thing. I don't, I don't know. Tools. It's a cloning tool. Something to that effect. Uh, I need us to grab a baggage bay or baggage hub is the one that I'm looking for. Um, and I'm thinking just kind of like that. It's about right. We can build that in there. Um, under construction, I'll start by dismantling this wall over here. And we can dismantle that piece there. And we can dismantle this piece over there. And then I can start by going to the utilities, getting this, this two-way conveyor. And we'll run, extend our two-way conveyor all the way to where we want to use it. Uh, actually, let's just um, tie it straight into there. So as soon as this thing is built, um, I'll, I'll quickly uh, change that to be a, a producer and a, the double one, the hub to hub. Yeah, the hub to hub so we can feed that. Okay, get that built over here. Can this please be a hub to hub? Thank you very much. Um, utilities. You just right click that uh, that one, by the way, and then you get uh, so if you kind of in here, you click on that, you right click on that and then you change what kind of endpoint it is. Um, this is going, I believe this is this is the one that's going up. How did this work? Anyway, both of them are there, but what do, what do we have here? So that's the receiver, that's the producer. That's the receiver. This is a producer, please. Okay, so now let's get our utilities over there. We'll get that piece of conveyor to go in there and we'll get this one to work like that. Perfect. Now, please finish off the construction over there. We need to get some nice other, other things as well. So a fair bit of money going around now. Tomorrow is the day that we will start operating these. We will move these guys over before midnight. Um, we'll move them over to these stands. Um, I'm, I'm not going to move these guys over there because they are smaller. So we'll see about finding them another another spot somewhere. But yeah, pretty cool. Making money, making money. We did do a little bit of expansion. Um, let's quickly see if we look at the research. Some of the stuff like escalators is very important. So we'll get working on escalators. One-way paths and one-way taxiways and stuff is, yeah, something that's still... Light rail transit is something that I still want to get done. Uh, allows configure runways to accept only departures or arrivals. That's something that certainly will work. Let's upgrade our buses as well. So let's do a few pieces of research. Hopefully we can do that pretty quickly and effectively. Yes, I like it. I like it. Um, that's in, all. Of, all of that's in place. What's going on? Why? What's what's your issue? Must be assigned to an aircraft grade. Okay, fair enough. Now let's assign you there, 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 and there. Nice. So that's all assigned. Um, probably uh, grab us another little baggage car. Okay, perfect. So we'll do that now. I think what we can start looking at is actually moving some of the flights over. So if I go to this flight schedule and we'll see what is already most of the flights, at least all of the morning flights has been moved, uh, moved along. So how can I, can I expand this a little bit? Yeah, I can. So what I want to do is I want to <clears throat> move these guys over here. Perfecto Mondo. Okay, let's do let's do these kind of very aggressively staggered. It's kind of what I'm what I'm thinking. So we very aggressively stagger those. Um, a little something like this. Ooh. There's another one here that we can kind of quite aggressively stagger, I believe. Like so, yeah. Is it from this one? 
I hope I'm taking it from the right ones. Uh, we'll do a little, a little something like this and see, see if that does us any good. Okay, so that's a one and a two. Something like this. So these will obviously only take effect tomorrow. So I'm not too, too fussed by sorting them out now. So hopefully that means that our two remote stands. Uh, and the question being here actually um, is should we Should we expand our operation a little? Okay, uh, because I think we've got enough room to to maneuver these out a little more. Okay, so we've 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 expanded the that a little. There we go. So we've expanded that a bit. Let's move this forward. So these guys, uh, we'll give them a little bit extra time. We'll move that to the edge there to see that we kind of get things sorted out. Okay, and this one over there, and then that one over there, and see these. We need to move these up a little. Okay, I think that's kind of okay. Then we can bring that in there. Um, but we also need to... Uh, oof, that might be tight. Not sure that's gonna, gonna cut it. Anyway, we're still working on it. Uh, that one I've already expanded. Now this one. Actually, how much does that do? That is a, an hour and 40 minutes. That is an hour and 30 minutes. So this one still needs to be expanded. There we go. There we go. Hour and 40 minutes. Nice. Uh, we'll need to move these up a little. So expand that one by one. Then we expand this one. And then we move that one over there. And we expand it a little bit. So there's one... That's not quite cutting it right there. But anyway, that's that's okay. So that tomorrow, this will be be the thing. B5 to 6 and 6 will be pretty busy um, uh, in the day of tomorrow. Sounds like a weird sci-fi movie title. I hope all of that works. Oh, what we would need to do is um, get some cues going over here. So let's quickly slot in those cues. Um... I'm kind of thinking that the queuing should do a little something. Oh, that's not actually going to work for us. Let's uh, let's 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 shrink that again and let's uh, try it, try it one more time. Do 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 do. Okay, now let's start it over. I'm not sure that's going to work actually. So let's uh, yeah, yeah, that's okay. Let's do this. That's okay. I am not a fan of doing it this way, but that's okay. So that's the one side, and then this side is the other. Okay. Then what I'll do is this side. I'm going to do. like so and here I'll be doing that nice absolutely okay so there we go that's pretty cool now over here 
you are going to be assigned to this queue over here for first class and here for coach you on the other hand you're going to be assigned over here for first class and over there for coach perfect i'm hoping this is sufficient queue space for the guys and let's quickly get ourselves a little bit of bench space in here as well we are working with this kind of bench stuff uh, actually let's get ourselves um, some benches placed kind of right over there um, and then we'll just do a little bit of rows of benches over here so let's just do um, yeah let's just do something like that like that that um, oh yeah that's gonna work beautifully excellent so there's now there's some bench space over there um, I'm also tempted to grab a bit of a vending machine or two let's grab a food vending machine on this side and a drinks vending machine on that side and we need some garbage garbage bins and stuff uh, so we'll just slot one in there and one in there so we'll see if that does the thing the, the trick um, and then I also want to put some plants in here just a little bit of plants not palms plants uh, we'll grab just some of these there and there there and there okay now so that that means that tomorrow we should be able to operate our remote stands on this side i'm hoping uh it's going to make be able this kind of stuff is going to make us be more effective at managing little um unused spaces of a terminal structure so that's why i thought it was especially um good for kind of the, some of these um satellite type terminals oh, we could have done a done that thing over there anyway that's fine um guys that's going to be the end of this episode uh, i think things are tracking along quite nicely we are making a fair bit of money we are kind of getting the new stuff sorted out i'm very excited to see the remote stands in the next episode but yeah you'll have to come back for that one so hit that uh, like button and subscribe to the channel hit that little bell notification um thing <laughs> so that you don't miss when we actually update or run the remote stands tomorrow see you next time bye bye